What's going on everyone? It's time for another horror pack unboxing. This is the June DVD pack uh, that I'm going to be unboxing today. Um, we still got the Blu-ray one to do and then July there's probably not going to be any because I'm having payment issues and stuff. Uh, I have to skip the July one but I'll be back probably for the August ones. But yeah, um, let's do the DVD horror pack. So, uh, if you're not sure what horror pack is, it's a monthly subscription service that sends in um, Sends you four new DVDs or Blu-rays, whichever one you choose, and where you get both. Um, yeah, and the Blu-ray one usually has a horror pack exclusive, which is either something signed, something that's never been released on Blu-ray, more features or something like that. This is the DVD one, so usually it's a whole pile of indie films and stuff, but let's see what we got. Hopefully it's something interesting. Uh, yeah, I've usually been pretty successful not seeing or had or even heard of half, half the stuff they sent. So I haven't looked at these yet. I just cut it open and I'm trying to get the first one out right now. So first film of the DVD pack is End Trip. Interesting. This looks more like a slasher uh, film. Um, yeah. Nothing I never heard of it, never really even seen a trailer for it or anything. And trip. So you got your slasher thriller it looks like here. Interesting. Um next we got Hollows Grove. Nice. This looks like a haunted house type film. Or even like a found footage type movie. It's from Vision Films. Never heard of them, but okay. Um, yeah, looks like your typical haunted, ghost hunting, um, found footage, haunted house type movie. Nice. That's cool. Definitely a lot of cool ghost images on the back there. Um, third one we got is Girls Just Want to Have Blood. Being a teenager sucks. This is like a vampire, I think, comedy. Um, but yeah, you got a typical vampire movie in here. I'm not huge in the vampire films, but some of them are interesting. But yeah, that's from Wild Eyes, so it's probably going to be like really low budget crap, like fun stuff. But uh, yeah, it's from Anthony Kostansky. His stuff is usually not that bad though, so yeah. And then finally, we've got a slip cover, which is usually a good sign. Um, Oh, wow. I'm surprised I got this. I actually have a review for this one. This is Shudder's original The Banishing. Now, this movie's terrible, but I don't have it yet. It's a haunted house movie, uh, very religious oriented and stuff. It does have some good dark imagery in it, and it has some good haunted house vibes. It's just very typical, and it, but wow, we got a new film <laughs> pretty much. This film came out last year on Shudder, and now we got the DVD for it. So. That is actually good. This here is probably worth the price of four pack alone. So yeah, we got some good stuff. We got some, yeah, you know, yeah, haunted house, uh, religious stuff, the banishing. Uh, you got a vampire creature type film. Girls just want to have blood. And then you got your haunted house found footage film, Hollows Grove, and a thriller slasher film and trip. So there's a little bit here for everyone, for the most part. Um, I, st I think it's a good power. I don't have any of these, so yeah, another good little, little haul. Um, but yeah, I've seen one of them, and I know, I think Hollow's Grove is supposed to be a decent film, so, um, I know I'm looking forward to checking out those ones, but yeah, definitely an interesting horror pack. Now, the DVD pack's usually $19.99 or something like that for a year subscription, and, uh, the Blu-ray ones are like $24.99 or something. They could have been changed by now, but uh, yeah, so keep that in mind. And they also have different tiers. You get, you get a one pack, where you get a three pack uh, tier, or a six, I think it's a six pack and then a year pack, but I could be wrong, but yeah. So that's the June 2022 horror pack. Still a good one, uh, a lot of cool stuff. We've got some stuff most people probably heard of and seen, like the banishing. And a couple indie films. That's actually one of the better ones of the DVDs in the recent times. So, yeah, pretty pleased with it. So, yeah, well, that's it for this one. Comment down below if you want me to review any of the other three films here that I haven't seen and put a review up. Let me know if you want me to do that. And um, also check out my review for The Banishing, which is on this channel as well. And I guess, um, yeah, hopefully 
uh, you're interested in horror pack this is sponsored by the by the way and uh there's a link for horror pack down below if you want to check it out but um yeah well that's it for this one um so yeah i guess uh keep on supporting horror films and films you love and i guess i'll see you all in the next one which will probably be another film review so see you in the next one cheers